privilege, not a burden. Okay? It's a privilege to be part of Fitment. Yun ang gusto kong parating. What is up, guys? Welcome to a new video here at Fitment TV. It's Kyle from Fitment Engineering. We, are, we have a unit release video again once more. This is our STI na ginawa nung Buena Mano video natin. Remember? We bagged it in one day. We actually prepared ahead of time for this car. Ngayon, I just want to make a video kasi hindi natin ito pwedeng shoot ng So You Want to Bag Your STI. Bakit? Kasi meron na tayong So You Want to Bag Your WRX, which is the same car. So I don't want to miss out on this car. Madami kami nagawa for this car. Kaya ang ganda na kinalabasan ng coaching to. This, this had a major transformation. Kaya I want to showcase it to you. That's why we're making this unit release video where we will talk about kung anong ginawa namin sa coaching ito. Of course, we did the air suspension. We did the wheels. We did the body kits. Well, we actually collaborated with some shops to get this item. So we're gonna feature them here. Ngayon, unang-una sa lahat. Let's show you the first modification na ginawa ng client dito. And obviously, ang una niyang ginawa dito is yung air suspension. It wouldn't be a fitment video kung wala tayong air suspension. Okay? If you're an avid viewer, you know that I previously owned a WRX. And this is just, you know, full circle for me because getting to work on another Subaru, nakakamiss din naman sila. So, we're gonna air out the car. Looks good. So, the STI right in front of us is actually using a pressure-based leveling system from our shop, Fitment. So, kinonvert natin yung kanyang tain coilovers into air suspension and we'll get, to the, we'll get to that in a bit. Pero so far, ito yung kinalabasan ng kotse. Let's get into detail kung anong mga ginawa natin. Umpis, umpisahan natin dito sa wheels ng kotse, okay? Sa wheels natin, ang wheel choice natin for this STI is courtesy of DZ Racing kay Kuya Alfi. Alex of Banawi Boy actually hook us up with Boss, Al Boss Alfi and we got the wheels. This is an NK or NK as the Filipinos love to call it. An NK GTC02. It's a 19 by 9. Alright? So, I always wanted to do 19s na fitment dito sa WRX and this is actually looking pretty good. Okay? The blue paint and the gunmetal silver actually complement each other. I personally love the color combination. Some people don't, but for me, it's nice. The owner wants something specific. Eh. He wants something na pwede niyang i-daily. Okay? He wants something na pwede niyang i-daily yung itsura. Not too stance, not too sporty, parang in between. Parang, alam mo yun? For me, the wheel design of this car is actually really good. And it was a great choice. Tingnan natin yung likod. Tingnan natin yung fitment sa likod. Fitment natin sa likod. So you can see, tamang-tama ang 19s dito sa coaching to. Ang problema ko kasi sa 18, they tend to, you know, parang kulang. Parang kulang yung drop niya. I don't know. Napupunggukan ako sa itsura ng 18. Ngayon, ako nagagandahan ako. I personally love this build. I personally love the color combinations as I told you. So, yeah, this is what we went with. It's a 19 by 9 square. Bakit tayo hindi nag 19 point? Bakit hindi tayo nag 19 by 9.5? Ang problema kasi natin pag 9.5 boys and girls, eh, medyo stressful sa steering, transmission ng STI. You don't really need that wide of a track or wide of a wheel kung hindi ka naman magta-track. Kung daily use ka nga, ang recommended natin, 8.5. Yung mga race, TE37, Puro 8.5 lang sila. So, by 9 is actually pushing it a bit. Pero good for daily pa rin to. Personally love it. Okay? Shout out kay DZ Racing. Second na gusto kong i-shout out sa build natin ito is si Galliard Tropa ni Anton. He actually hooked us up with his charge speed. Okay? This is a wraparound. May side skirt tayo, rear spot, and then chin. Okay, counting note, I had one of these before pero hindi ako nag-carbon kasi masisira lang sa akin. And charge speed was one of my best choice kasi ang maganda sa charge speed sa STI WRX, 
it actually makes your whole chin drop by like two inches from the stock bumper na linya. So shout out kay Galliard, kay G. Tag namin sa kanya G, si China man. How are you, bro? Thank you for hooking up the client with your carbon fiber. As you can see, ganito yung nagiging trend dito sa amin. Okay? We don't really sell these. We just hook the client up with our friends. So, bubuo kami ng kotse. Tatawagin namin yung mga tropa. Alam mo yun? Tawag namin sa mga tropa. Pare, baka meron ka dyang side skirt. Ganyan, ganyan. Sir Alfie, Sir Alex. So, nakikipag-coordinate tayo sa mga ibang shop. So, in turn, even though fitment ang gumawa ng air suspension, sila nagkakabit lahat. Other shops can actually collaborate with us building several cars, different cars, different parts. So, yun yung magandang parts sa ginagawa ko ngayon as a builder. nag enjoy ako makipag, alam yun, coordinate with a lot of shop owners, be friends with shop owners. Yun yung nagugustuhan ko sa ginagawa ko ngayon for building cars itself. So, this is the rear spot. Final touch. Actually, kakakabit lang nila to. So, medyo madumi pa. Sorry. So, anyway, yun yung fitment sa likod. Looking good. I actually love the way it turned out. Alright, so, so far, na-discuss natin sa inyo yung air suspension, obviously. Showed you the wheel design of the car. We have the side skirt chain from G. Charge speed. Now, let's pop up. Let's pop the hood. May mga bagay tayong pwedeng i-discuss dito. Okay? We actually work with Auto Line. Okay? We work with Boss Alex Ong, Alexander Ong, dito sa Maysobel. He helped us with the client. Boss Alex of Auto Line actually helped us on this car kasi may tama na yung rock and pin yun niya. So, so, side note is that pagkarating dito ng kotse, maingay na yung side yung kanya steering. Uh, nirecommend namin siya kay Boss Alex of Autoline dyan sa may katabi lang namin, halos. Working with them, they loved what we did for the air suspension. As you may have known, Autoline was previously doing air suspension as well. They were carrying airlift performance. So, from a coming from a veteran air suspension builder, natuwa siya sa build natin. So, thank you Boss Alex for you. Shout out sa inyo, Autoline, one of the oldest shops here in Makati, specializing in Subaru, especially WRX and STIs. Okay? So, addition to that, Boss Alex actually was the one that supplied us the Tain Flex Z Colovers for the WRX STI. At uh, kung nang napanood nyo yung So You Want to Bag Your WRX, we actually use the same type of coilovers. I actually preferred Tain talaga. Sobrang happy ako sa performance ng Tain. So, yun. So, I can't show you kung anong ginawa ni Boss Alex ong sa steering kasi nasa ilalim siya. But basically, if you want to see the engine bay of this car, this is actually modified. Na. If I'm not mistaken, this is making around shy of 400 baba ba, na horsepower. I'm not sure. But the owner told me and Boss Alex told me it was actually modified already. So overall, yun lang naman yung gusto kong gawin sa video na ito. So I showcase yung mga tumulong sa atin, bumuo. Yung mga people na nag-provide sa atin ng mga items. This car looks great. It, ha it has a great transformation. So, I really wanted to document it for the sake of the channel talaga. Okay? So, what do you guys think? Do you like this type of videos? Okay? Siyempre, ayoko namang maiwan sa area yung mga clients na hindi makakasama sa So You Want to Bag Your Series. Kaya gusto kong gawin to. I want them to be featured kahit na may catalog tayo. I think every build na ginagawa namin dito is special to the clients. So, uh, just like a piece of memory, a piece of history para sa kanila na mababalikan nila na, uy, ganito yung ginawa ni na Kyle back then. Yun yung parang gusto kong gawin dito. It's something we can go back to and something we can showcase as well for other clients. So, shout out sa inyo, Autoline, DZ Racing, KG, Galliard. Thank you sa mga tumulong for this build. It turned out really well. Uh, from a all-stock STI, we actually have a very, very modified-looking looking STI. Bag, wheels, tires, charge speed kit, full steering rack assembly, nayos. A lot of it, it was actually a maintenance and a modification for the, for the owner's car, di ba? So, without further ado, tatapusin natin tong video. So, this build wouldn't be complete kung hindi natin ito lalagyan ng signature sticker natin. 
Okay, our FTMNT sticker. Okay, fun fact, FTMNT is Marion's name. He helped me start my business by letting me borrow FTMNT. Okay, this is, uh, this is a tradition namin dito. We actually put this as a, not as branding, okay? We put this as a commitment kasi pag nilagay ko ito sa kotse mo, tayo-tayo lang ang may ganito. Hindi si Mario nagbebenta nito. Hindi kami namimigay nito. We only put this on the cars na ginawa namin. At pag nilagyan namin yung kotse mo nito, it's a commitment na pag may nangyaring masama sa'yo, we have to protect you. Kasi our name is on your car. That's why this is very important to me, for the clients, for the beat, for the team. Pag may ganito ka, we, we put you first. Before anything else, kung may mga yari sa yon. That's why we take care of the clients. This is why some of our clients or some are actually aspiring to be part of Fitment, kasi we take it very seriously. Pag nilagay ko tong pangalan ni Marion or pangalan namin or pangalan ng nagsimula or whatever we're putting there, we have to commit that we will take care of that car. This is supposed to be a privilege, not a burden. Okay? It's a privilege to be part of Fitment. Yun ang gusto ko parating. So. Gonna try to install. Okay, ang tradition namin dito is talagang ihiga ako sa lupa. Kasi the only way I can put this straight is to line up my head properly. Okay, this is my tradition. Sabi ng nila, one day, Sir Kyle, na papahiga din kita, and this is what they mean. Na papahiga nila ako sa lupa kasi lalagay ko sila na sticker. So it's actually quite, you know, therapeutic for me doing this. It kind of made me feel like Akira Nakai from RWB when he actually brands his stickers sa kotse. Pag natatapos na niya, lalagyan niya ng pangalan yung kotse. He actually wanted to put the name of the car on the side like the ones they do in RWB nga. Katulad ng Stella Artois, Okay, yung kay Boss Angie, Victoria, Noah, Akira. And this is how it is. This is actually, okay, this is, that's very important for me and for the client. It's a mark of relation na, yes, we indeed build the car na. We built the car. Alright, now that the sticker is done, the... Pagkakabit na sticker, itapos na. That's going to be the end of the video. The owner is actually here. Si Boss Mike nandito na. So we're gonna turn over the car. We're gonna release the unit. And he's going to have fun with his new bag, STI. Okay, hopefully, hope enjoys. And of course, it will have the, all the fitment amenities na pwede namin ibigay para sa kanya. Sa mga tumulong ulit on building this car, thank you so much. It was a fun build, nonetheless. And this is the pleasure of being a builder, even though it's not my car. It's actually very nice for me. It feels nice to build the car for the client. Kasi kahit nga, sabi ko, kahit di ko kotse, building it feels like I'm doing it for myself. So that's how, that's how we do it. Medyo personal yung pagkakabuild ng kotse, kaya inaalagaan namin. Matagal, matagal ang release kasi we want it perfect. Kasi we treat it as our own car. So, yun lang naman ang gusto kong ipakarating sa ating video na ito. Hope you like this unit release video. Check out the pictures on our social media. Okay? We'll be uploading the pictures of this car, high resolution. Facebook, Instagram, follow us at Fitment TV. Fitment Engineering at Facebook. Fitment TV at Instagram. Of course, if you're watching this video, subscribe to the channel. This is what we do. We actually bag cars, modify cars at the same time. Collaborate with a lot of shop owners. And this is what we can do for you, for your car, and for whatever. Okay? I'll see you guys in the next episode. It's been Kyle from Fitment Engineering, and you're watching Fitment TV. Adios.